Hello everybody and welcome back to Persona 3 FBS. In the last episode, tragedy struck as Uncle Ikutsuki betrayed us because we didn't like his jokes and Mitsuru's dad, aka the best Tokyo drifter. was taken from our grasp and murdered by the betrayer. Now the art of Tokyo Drift has been lost from this land. And it's a damn shame too. You know, in all seriousness, this game is definitely killing off everybody's parents. By the end of this game, everyone's mom and dad is gonna be dead. And you know what? I look forward to it. The game ending, I mean, not everyone's parents dying. Anyways, let's let's get out there and do some social linking. Uh, all right. Is the monk in today? I don't think he is. This game. Oh, he's here. I was about to say this game is against me all the time. All right. Oh, it's you. Mutatsu seems to be drinking by himself. Would you? S <laughs> well, sure. I don't have a persona for you, but that's okay. We can we can make it work. I was just thinking you might show up, and here you are. Hey, don't get me wrong, kid. It's not like I was looking forward to seeing you or anything. What's the deal with your head, kid, or your hair? Is that what's, uh, what's in style nowadays? Doesn't it get in your eyes? My son kept his hair long too. You should cut it. No, better yet, shave it all off. Smooth like me, baby. Smooth and shiny, get all the ladies on your dick. A bald main protagonist? Man, I'm about to look like a badass Vin Diesel. Let's go. <laughs> You don't get it, kid. Mutatsu seems... Wait, did he say you do get it or you don't? I'm... Whatever. I'm not talking about fashion here. I'm saying you'd be better off without your hair. Oh, okay. He did say you don't get it. Oh, sure. You're young and good looking now, but just wait. I mean, look at me. I'm old and ugly. My cheeks sag like a damn bulldog's. Man, based. That's life, kid. People get old. Someday you'll be just like me. Not true. Main protagonists don't age. We stay swagalicious. You'll look in the mirror and think, damn, I was handsome back in the day. Here's a little trick so you don't lose hope in the future. Just don't expect nothing simple, eh? And that way you won't ever be disappointed. You gotta lose your hair eventually, kid. So why bother with it now? All this beautiful, baby. You just wake up in the morning and go. No fuss. Get all the ladies. Shiny, shiny booty on your head. You know what I'm saying? I can even give you money for the shave. Come on, bro. We can be buddies. We can be twins. All right, you saw through Mutatsu's harsh words and felt his kindness. I, but like, I didn't feel like those were harsh words. That was just like simple advice to getting ladies. Come on, man. No, but in all seriousness, he wasn't saying anything overtly harsh. He was... It, it was advice. He wasn't yelling at me to fucking shave my hair. Alright, you understand Mutatsu better now. Do I? What rank is this again? Take a look. Hmm... Are we more than halfway through now? No, level 4. We're almost halfway there. You are getting sleepy. What? Is all my talk putting you to sleep? Well, you can't sleep here, kid. Go home. You decided to go back home. To the dorm. Back home to the dorm. Horm dorm. Oh, she's watching the video. Man, I kind of feel bad for 
Um, for Yukari's dad, he looks like a tired office employee. Looks so sad, bro. He looks so dissatisfied with life. And this experiment should have never even been conceived. That's why I had to interrupt it. However, in doing so, I set free a number of shadows that are certain to torment future generations. Wait, you did it? But if I hadn't, the entire world may have paid the price. Wait, was your dad, was her dad the cause of the explosion? Am I getting this right? Sheesh. Talk about sacrificing people to, you know, prolong the human race, I guess. Please listen carefully. I cannot stress this enough. You must not hunt the shadows that have dispersed. And I oop. Well, oops. Damn. Sorry. We killed all of them, kind of, sorta. Because they were, you know, scrubs. Huh? This part's... I wasn't able to stop this madness. He won't listen no matter what I say. He's under the devil's spell. Ooh. Now the shadows are trying to eat one another. But if they're reunited, then we are all doomed. Wait, but then if I kill them and they don't reunite... Doesn't that mean we're good? So wait, if you kill them, it's bad. But if you they reunite, it's good. So then how are you supposed to keep them apart? And, and am I just... Confuzzling, bro. Confuzzling. I'll say this once more. Leave the shadows be. But that's the pro... If, why? If we leave them be, they're gonna reunite. And keep killing people. That's not something we can necessarily do. Like. The whole earth. Or a whole country getting apathy syndrome. Is basically just as bad as people dying. Just based on how these apathy syndrome victims are. This is the original video. Before Ikutsuki changed it. Dad tried to stop the experiment. There's not much hope for me now. I have just one favor to ask. Whoever finds this, please give my daughter Yukari this message. I know I promised I'd be home soon, and I'm sorry to break that promise. But I want you to know, Daddy was the happiest man on earth when he was with you. I love you, Yukari. Please take care of yourself. Dad? Dad? And there it is. Damn. That sucks. But at least she gets to see the final moments of her dad. How they truly played out. for sure now I was right to believe in him are you listening dad I'm doing okay it took a while but I finally got your message oh crap wait is everybody getting a new persona no matter if I have a social link with them or not Is that what's happening? Oh my god, that looks amazing. Low has given rise to Isis. Com looks completely different than all the Shin Megami Tensei series. I'll fight for what I believe in. That's what you would have wanted. Right, Dad? Wait, doesn't that Isis also look different? Then the Isis in Persona 4. Let me, I'm gonna take a look and I'm gonna post 
a uh, PNG of uh, Isis in Persona 4 here, just to make sure, because I, I feel like, I don't know, maybe I'm tripping. But yeah, okay, if this is the rate it's going, then everybody's getting their ultimate personas, no matter if they're in a social link with me or not. But in Persona 4, it's different, because in Persona 4, you have to max everyone's social link up to get their ultimate personas. And then they get a second iteration of their ultimate personas after some time, from what I remember. And in this one, it looks like they give it their they give them their first ultimate personas regardless. And maybe if you max them out, you get their second max persona. Maybe I don't know. Actually, I don't know how that would work. Because if we max them out before this event, then they probably wouldn't have had their ultimate personas either way until this moment so you know i don't know what i'm talking about maybe maybe not all right i don't feel well so let's sleep i don't know how i don't feel well those last two bottle those last two battles we went through were easy as hell bro we are seriously op and there's no question about it anyways from maxing our best friends social link we got the ability to fuse thanatos which is the guy on the upper right, the monster we saw at the beginning, uh, when our character got our got his powers, and he looks cool as hell. I'm gonna see his move set, and I'm gonna try to fuse him next time I go into the, uh, the tower. Just to see, cause you know he's probably the ultimate persona, cause every game seems to have one or a couple ultimate personas, and I'm gonna get the most powerful of the most powerful. I'm gonna get the pinnacle. Of power for personas per 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 personas god damn it and uh, i'm gonna save those onyxes i currently have to max the stats of that ultimate persona so that i could beat the boss's ass with max stats baby because you know you guys know how i do i'm gonna take all the opportunities i can get and i'm gonna make sure to to pound them into excellence because that's how i do i am a blacksmith of RPGs, baby. All right, let's go. What's up, Igor? What you call me here for? As I'm sure you are aware, you are currently in a dream. Igor, I don't mean to be a giant asshole, but you say this every time. I know, buddy. Come on, man. Now then, there has been a change in you recently. Have you noticed? What, that I'm a level 70 powerful OP MC? Yes, I have noticed. And I am not referring to your change in circumstances. I am referring to the change in your mentality. In my mentality? That is why I have summoned you here tonight. What does that mean? Going forward, there is one thing you mustn't forget. It is the contract you signed. I see you recognize it. Shall I remind you of your commitment? I know, I'm gonna take responsibility for all of my actions. But what does a change in mentality have to do with this? I guess he doesn't want me to do something crazy? But, you know, Igor, just because my mentality's changed doesn't mean that I'm a completely different person. I chooseth this fate of mine own free will. There is no need to worry. Whichever path you choose, I shall respect your decision. That's why you're a real G, Igor. However, only you will bear the responsibility for your actions. I know, that, that's how it's been ever since the first game. No matter what end they may bring about. Please, remember that. Well then, I bid you farewell. See ya. See ya later, Igor. When I fuse all the ultimate personas, I'm gonna show you how powerful and OP I am. Just you wait. Alright, I thought he was gonna give us a new fusion thing or something. But I guess not. He's just like, here, let me wave this contract in front of your face so that you know that that you know you signed a contract and you remember that you did yo 
Chidori. Yo, Sasuke's move. What's up? Sorry about not being able to come lately. Uh, a lot's been going on. Your friends died, by the way. At least I think. They fell they they jumped off a bridge. Hey, what's wrong? So you heard about Takaya and Jin, huh? I was planning on telling you. How did she hear about them? They were your friends after all. What? That's not it? I'm scared. It hurts. Junpei, what will you be doing in two years? Two years? I don't know. I really haven't thought about it. Junpei, you're just gonna ignore the fact that she said it hurt? Why do you ask? Hey, I, I noticed you stopped, you know, uh, hurting yourself. Oh, I guess. Well, that's good. I mean, you have such beautiful hands. <gasps> Don't touch me. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. oh uh, sorry. I, I didn't mean to. This is too painful. It used to be fun when you came to visit. Uh-oh. Oh, no. But it's different now. Anymore. What do you mean? I, I don't understand. Now, the question is whether she's mad that he was a part of what got her friends killed, which I think that's it, but or or whether she's like in love with him and she's never felt that. Did, did I do something wrong? Tell me what it is. No. But uh, Shidori. Oh no. Did my did my dude just get cut? Oh no, bro. That's sad. He can't clap them cheeks anymore. That's awful. God damn it. Rip Junpei's balls. All right. Let's get out of here and do some social linking. What personas do I have, by the way? I definitely have one for the Strength Arcana, right? Hermit, Priestess, Hero, Hyro. Oh, Strength. I do have a Strength. So, Yuko is not here, of course, because why would she be? Not like I want to hang out with her or anything. All right, we can hang out with the... Uh, wait. Yeah, we can hang out with the Mitsuru now, right? But you know what? I'm not going to start another social link. Especially with a girl, because everyone else is going to get jealous. So let's do some student count. Oh, crap. come on, man. All right, baby. I guess you are right, my friend. Tetsuya Sama, I have been waiting for you. Let us go to the Ehomes Economics Group. It seems Baby wants to hang out. Yes. Zooing is so much fun. Baby seems happy. Nice. Very exotic, my friend. Kevkan High School Home Economics Room. Two sewing machines buzz steadily in sync. It said cinch, but I'm gonna let it pass. You're having a good time hanging out with Bebe. Today, our work is over on Wadi. Let's go to this sweet shop, Tetsuya Sama. This is my first time going. Will you go teach me? Sure, let's go. Oh, you are the best. Thank you, Arigato. Bebe seems excited. Well then, shall we go? 
We'll go together. My Tomodachi, my friend. You don't have to say it twice, you know? Chicka wow wow, chicka wow, chicka wow, chicka wow wow. All right, Iwatodai Strip Mall Sweet Shop. You are having a delectable time with Bebe. Oi, she's at dessert. That's delicious. I am so happy. Who is she? I love the culture of Nihon. Japan is sugoi amazing. How's your country? My country is nothing compared to Nihon. Japan is number one, Ichiban. I wish I was born here. Baby seems a little sad. Ah. Oh. Sorry I brought it up. I want to learn everything about Nihon and become Japanese. Thank you for bringing me here, Tetsuya-sama, arigato. I have an aunt who lives back home. She has been helping me. I must tell her that I have made a friend, Tomodachi. Bebe seems truly grateful. Your relationship is stronger now. Ah. This is rank 2 of Temperance, I think. Because I don't think I've hung out with him after establishing his social link. So, yep, two. Interesting, interesting character. Oh, look at the time. I would like to ask you more about Nihon. I'll see you later, sayonara. You decided to go back to the dorm. Damn. Oh? Elizabeth, are you calling to tell me that I finally unlocked a new section of Tartarus? In that case, that is exciting. Hello, this is Elizabeth. I'm calling to inform you of a change in Tartarus. I believe a path that was blocked is now open. I thought you would like to know. Wish you a safe journey. The phone call has ended. Alright. Looks like Mitsuru won't be coming back for a while. I'd like to think that she'll be okay, but I'm not so sure this time. Oh, do we have to find her and hang out with her to make her feel better? Maybe. Alright, I'll try to find her at school then. Some dances want to put you in a trance. I say hey, hey, hey. All right, we're gonna go check the Velvet Room for new quests. Oh God, there's someone over there with Apathy Syndrome just... Actually, that's not that bad. She looks like she's staring at the stars. Kinda creepy though, still. Boom, boom, boom. I've never felt like boo, 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 boo. I really need to learn the lyrics to these songs. I really do, so I can sing along properly and not mumble rap my way through the damn things. All right, check for quests. Oh yeah, I remember when Junpei was glitching all up in this place. All right, accept requests. Let's take a look. Bring me a Featherman figure. I'd like an action figure of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. You know what? I'm not going to do an inner voice. I think its owner will be in a good mood on 1121. 1121. 1121. Please find the missing person. I'm afraid this missing girl has apathy syndrome. Do you find her and bring her a drink to cure her condition? There are drinks to cure apathy, thing apathy syndrome? I'm sorry, what? Um, since when? You'd think that the hospitals would figure this shit out. What the hell? Elizabeth, why do you have, do you have the cure for cancer too? What the hell is going on? All right, you know what? This is, this sounds interesting. Okay, made outfit A is the reward for that. And I'm... I want to see that maid outfit. Maid outfit Y. Oh, what's A? 
I guess? Main outfit, why, Yukari? Alright, please go scrub the bathroom. Scrubbing the bathroom is difficult, but necess necessary task. Take your brush in hand and help clean the floors. What the hell are all these random quests? Alright, bring me food fit for a wolf. Please bring me some gourmet dog food. You may be able to get some on 11-12, when he who holds it is in a good mood. Gourmet dog food. Gourmet dog food? From... Wait, are we gonna ask the dog to give us some of his food? That sounds mean. Alright, I'd like to try Odin juice. I would love to try your world's Odin juice. The drink-loving girl near the persimmon tree may have some. Uh, oh, I'd like to visit Gekukan High. I can no longer hide my curiosity about your world. Please take me to Gekukan High after school. Alright, I'll take that on tomorrow so I won't get any more quests than I already have. Alright, retrieve the last old document. So this is the definitive end of the tower. Alright, retrieve three moon tablets. Six pink feathers. So after my next grinding session, I should try to fuse all the personas. And then something I really want to do as well is try fighting the, the Reaper. Because I swear to God, that guy shows up all the time in this game, which is ridiculous. Um, but... Once I kick his ass, I'm going to be happy. I don't know what the reward is for kicking his ass in this game. I know in the next game over, in Persona 4, he gives you equipment that is very, very good. In this game, it's probably like, I don't know, a bunch of money or something. Alright, so let's get out of here. Let's go scrub the toilet and show her Gekukan High tomorrow, I guess. Since she doesn't really take up any time. Kill two birds with one stone. Alright, wait. Monkey Moo, are you there? Boom, boom, boom. Alright. Yes, you are. Oh, it's you. Mutatsu seems to be drinking by himself. We're probably not gonna rank up. Nope, just a hangout session. I should really get a persona of his social link so that I could level up faster. But then again, I don't really have to because then I'll go back to doing nothing at night anyways. Alright. So, I mean, I don't, I don't feel bad dragging out his social link because that just means I have something to do mostly every night instead of as opposed to just going to game panic and uh, raising stats that are already raised. Oh, hey, yeah! A good old session of eavesdropping on conversations. Jeez, they found someone with apathy syndrome at my cram school, too. They're all over the place. You know, I hear the problem isn't just limited to this city. It's happening everywhere. I wonder what's going to happen to this country. Don't say this country. First bell has rung. No, that girl has, uh, the right... The right, uh... I don't know, uh, plane of thought, I guess. Hey, I guess, you wanna say something? For some reason, I was unable to concentrate on the lesson. That is very unlike me. Ah, uh, you're starting to turn more human and human. I hope I can social link you eventually. It'd be really interesting to see what your social link will comprise of. Yuko? Yay, she's here. But first, uh, waifu. Alright. First, we shall go show. We shall go show Elizabeth the school real quick. Because this will not take time. Hopefully. Hopefully, they don't change that up on me. But we should be fine. For the most part. Maybe. All right, Elizabeth, Elizabeth Torres. Reference to GTA 4 if anyone gets it. All right, no, not compendium requests. All right. 
I'd like to visit Gekukan High School. All right. Let's go. Yeah, go on a date with Elizabeth. Ah, I've been expecting you. Shall we be on our way? Yes, please. Such a warm, luminous place transforms into Tartarus each night. I know, right? Hmm. What should I do? Everyone here seems to be wearing a predetermined uniform. I may draw too much attention to myself. I hope this won't pose a problem. Oh my god, I would love to see Elizabeth in a school uniform. Oh god, what'll you do? Please excuse me as I make myself less conspicuous. Oh. Damn it, I thought she was gonna wear the uniform. Or do a magical girl transformation or something. Alright, Elizabeth moved very close behind you. Yes, please. If I stay hidden from view this way, there will be nothing to worry about. You know, Elizabeth, I rarely simp for women, but you may be a first. All right. Very inconspicuous. This is a surprise to find a bastion of commerce inside a house of learning. Could you please wait here for a moment? There's something I've been curious about for a while. Excuse me, I'd like to purchase a school lunch. Oh, yes? Elizabeth seems to be requesting something unreasonable. Uh, they only sell bread. I would have liked to taste these school lunches in their native environment. But I've heard that having bread for lunch can be a pleasure in itself. It may prove to be a serendipitous substitute. Serendipitous. Serendipitous. Very serendipitous. This school day is serendipitous. Elizabeth, may I just say, you are serendipitous. And yes, I'm gonna keep on saying and pronouncing, over-pronouncing the S on the end of serendipitous. Your eardrums will thank me later. Elizabeth seems to have brought, bought bread. Now that we're done here, I'd like to see your home room. God damn, do you want to see my bedroom too? Jeez. You headed to your home room with Elizabeth. I guess you could say it is very serendipitous. I can feel the careful thought and foresight from whoever arranged things this way. It's just basic organization for a classroom, Elizabeth. It's nothing special. This observation post must be what they call podium. I see. Standing behind it does cause a longing to teach, to well up inside of me. Please don't do something, stupid. First question. Oh god. Diet food, or super diet food, which is tastier? Uh, you know, usually diet food ain't that good actually maybe the name would stipulate that the super diet food is good because it's super 
but then if if I do it from the other way, diet food usually doesn't taste good, then super diet food would taste even worse, but if I did it backwards, then the super would imply that the super diet food tastes better than the diet food, but then, okay, alright, super diet food. You're welcome. Thanks, Elizabeth. Oh, oh, thank you. I actually got it. Is this what a classroom lecture is like? <laughs> no, everyone's staring at you because you're weird. I'm feeling rather uneasy with so many eyes on me. So let us move on with the tour. Well, this is what teaching entails, Elizabeth. You decided to walk around the school with Elizabeth. You know, Elizabeth is supposed to be Margaret's sister. And she's like a massive goofball. Wonder how that is. Run for your life. Oh god, whoa. Damn. Jeez. I wasn't expecting her to do that. Goddamn pole vaulting. Alright, you walked around the school with Liz Elizabeth. Damn! She's got the leg powers of Superman. Now that I've experienced student life, my outlook on your world has broadened even further. I'd be happy to accompany you again anytime. Oh, although, to be honest, I don't entirely understand my own motives in wanting to come here. You wanna be a waifu. That's your motive. Walking so closely beside you, I... How should I express this? I felt very fulfilled. Perhaps what I really wanted to learn at school was more about you. Oh, you're gonna learn more soon, girl. Just you wait. But why? In any case, discovering the reasons behind this desire should provide an intriguing diversion for me. We all already know why, right? Like, I'm not the only one that thinks it's very obvious. You headed back to the velvet room with Elizabeth. Perfection. It didn't take any time at all. Alright. Now, we shall take that other request for the girl by the persimmon tree. Oh, you seem to have completed a request. Thank you for showing me around the school. I'm slowly beginning to understand why being there lifted my spirits. Gekugan isn't just a part of your world. It's a place where you spend time on a daily basis. A place saturated with your presence. That's why I... I'll leave that aside for now. It requires further consideration. Instead, let me give you a reward. It's another special gift. With this, you can fuse Hellbiker. He is a frightful man. He's also a part of you, like the rest, he emerges from the sea of your soul. Please accept your reward. Red Muffler. Thanks for the bike part, Elizabeth. I will cherish this with my life. Or with my soul, shall I say. Alright. Let us go. Oh, what are the flowers? When I visited Gegukan High School, I saw a neglected patch of flowers. Could you bring them some water? Sure. Sure. Let's get some Odin juice from that girl first, and then we'll scrub the bathroom, and then we'll find the missing person. All these random side quests. I'm sure there are a bajillion people with, you know, apathy syndrome that are like down, conspicuous, creepy. Uh, alley somewhere, but they all, you know, they all, I don't know. They're all lost is my point. Let me look here just in case. She's probably down in alley somewhere. Should I even bother looking for her right now? Uh... You know what, let's go. 
ba 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 Oh, wait, isn't this the office lady who was the reporter? Oh, that's sad. That's kind of sad. That's very sad. Alright, where's this girl who was lost? Hmm. Who are you? Oh, hold on. Dude, do you see that? She helped the cat that those brats were picking on. Then she fed it some real high-class gourmet cat food. Such a stray cat, why is she making such a fuss about it? Man, you like this girl, don't you? Aw, oh, this guy follows me around and just won't quit. He must be one stubborn guy to follow me around that much. He'd make a great detective. Yeah, and he'd make a great husband material. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, girl? Alright. Oh, wait. Hmm, strange. The victims from the... From that incident aren't going away. Usually they disappear after the full moon, but maybe something's changed and I didn't notice. But whatever it is, it doesn't seem good. Oh, you, wait, you're the reporter lady. I'm wrong. So then this is a completely different person. All right. Still sad. Also, the apathy syndrome people didn't disappear? Interesting. Interesting indeed. Okay, so that girl is not in this back alley. Oh, they're dead, by the way. Hmm. God damn it. God damn it, Bob. Boom, boom, boom. Bob, 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 bob. If you hold me tight. <laughs> oh, wait. Someone seems to be cleaning. Is this. Hey, you can't come in here. I'm still scrubbing the floors. Oh, you're not here to do your, uh, your business? Oh, okay, so you're here to help out, huh? Sorry, kid, I've only got the one brush here. If you really want to help, you'll have to come back with your own cleaning supplies. Well, if you had a cleaning implemented equipment, maybe you could help her. Well, I know where that quest is now. Okay, that's good. Something's good has come of this. So where do I get my own cleaning supplies? Hmm. Hmm, the only place I can think of is Polonia Mall. That's the only place I could possibly think of that has, you know, maybe shops that sell cleaning materials. All right. My class won the sports day. We set a new record for jumping rope. You think it's because our teacher put all his time into practice every day? Maybe. Oh, buddy. You're back to normal? Oh, yes. Yes. Taxi driver lives matter, goddammit. TDBM. Wait, no, no. TDLM. There you go. My co-worker got into an accident. He's got to wear a truss now. I feel so sorry for him. Can't work until his back heals. There's no works workman's comp for us cabbies. Oh, that sucks. Well, at least you don't have apathy syndrome anymore. Man, high five, bro. I missed you. All right, let's get out of here. Uh. Okay. No one with apathy syndrome here except for that guy in the corner. Mamoru's here. This kid is still here with the cat. His uh, fur is standing up. He seems to be bothered by something. What man and that lady? The old man and the old lady too. Why are they just standing there staring at nothing? Are they so tired that they don't want to do anything anymore? Oh. Are you talking about Bunkichi and Mitsuko? Oh. Hey, who are you? No one. Man, I was sure you'd be the student. Or the girl that's lost. Who are you? You do something bad to the sweet shop's mascot, Azuki-chan. You'll lose control of your bladder. She might be cute, but I don't think you can deface her. 
I don't know. I want to try now. All right, up here. This? It appears to be their mascot. Ah. Ah. Interesting. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Really, not here at all. Weird as hell, bro. What about Naganaki Shrine? Alright, Michael's here, but that's not who I'm looking for. Hmm. Nobody with apathy syndrome here? No. No. Well, damn. Maybe there's someone in front of the dorm doors? Maybe? Oh, wait. Who? Yo. Wait, no. That's not what I wanted to do. There's a girl there. She might be the last girl. Well, I... Okay. Well... Okay, then. I guess not. Interesting. I... I don't know. I, I don't know then. Oops. I might need to search that one up. Hmm. Can anyone give me cleaning supplies? Hey, those motionless kids, motionless kids near the club. Are they, are they the ones with apathy syndrome everyone is talking about? Oh, you're wearing too much. Are they just relaxing? Although they have been like that for a while. Are they going to stay in, stay there forever? Yes. What the hell? I heard rumor about Mr. Carrillo. Now tell the truth, Mr. Carrillo owned the company I used to work for, but it's none of my business now. Oh, did you get laid off? Hmm. If you hold me tight. Bob, 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 bob. Okay, whatever. Screw everybody then. Wait, maybe like a mop is a weapon that is being sold or something? No, no. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm. What the hell? Okay. Hmm. Okay. Not from here. Good to know. Uh, Shinshuido Antiques, maybe? In the item section? Man. So much crap to look for. Nope. Uh, well, bye bye I, I guess nothing. The pharmacy couldn't possibly sell mops, could they? It's just a small pharmacy with medicine, right? Nope, and I've already purchased literally everything from them. So then where the hell do I... Where the hell do I get it from? Well... Ah! Huh. Well, shoot! I guess I'll have to search that one up too. Well, too bad. Alright, let's go back to Gekukan High. Bum bum bum, bada ba 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 
Wait, can I check my locker in this game? Nope. Hi, Yukari. Bye, Yukari. Wait, where am I going? This way, I think. The persimmon tree? I can't get cleaning supplies from the bathroom here, right? Body is in excellent condition. All right, what about this? Nope. Boom, boom, ba 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 ba. Oh, Happy Henry likes beer, but could not obtain food. Every teacher has his or her own personal mnemonic for the first few elements in the periodic table. The one our teacher taught us is kind of raunchy, isn't it? Nah, that's the perfect. Perf. Oh, janitor's room. Oh, come on. You're telling me I can't take a mop or two? Come on, man. Okay, then. What you want? Okay, I'm playing RPG on my cell phone, so buzz off. Shut up, you scrub, before I stuff you in a locker. I know it, it, I don't, I know it's not very nice for a protagonist to do, but you're pissing me off, bro. Alright, do you have the Odin? And Kansai, huh? So, even if I take the bus, it'll cost around 10,000, 10,000 yen? How many drinks could I get with 10,000 yen? Rare Kansai drinks. I wonder how they taste. Rare Kansai drink. So. I need a drink from Kansai. Somehow. S somehow. I'm supposed to get a drink from Kansai. Alright, looks like I'll have to Google that one too. I have to Google everything. Damn it, bro. Why is it so hard to find out what to do with these? Alright, Yuko, let's hang out. I'm about to have an aneurysm from trying to figure out what to do with all these quests. Then why don't we go to my house? Don't worry, my room is clean. Already! Damn, Yuko, you work fast. And we're sitting on your bed too. Damn. You are celebrating your coaching success alone with Yuko. It was a lot of hard work, but I'm I'm glad we helped those kids. How about you, Tatsuya kun? Yuko is looking at you shyly. Yo, what's up, girl? Oh, I'm sorry, it didn't mean to stare. Just noticed that you have such long eyelashes. I've never seen you this close before. Blush? How about we change topics? I have a question for you. Do you like kids, Tatsuya-kun? Yeah, I like them. Me too, I like how they try so hard. You know, recently I realized how much I, li I like to take care of people. Can I ask you one more question before we call it a night? Let's say you get married and have a kid. Would you want it to be a boy or a girl? <sighs> hmm. Oh, God. In all honesty, I don't know. Maybe a boy. I know I would, I would really be very overprotective with my daughter if I had a daughter. But with a, with a, with I had a boy, I don't know. You know what? I'll go, I don't know. God damn it, I don't know. I don't know! I don't know! You know, there's different acts- there's different aspects to both of them. So, I- and I don't- I don't know. I don't know. You know, it doesn't matter which. Okay. Anyways, I wouldn't want the baby to take after me since I'm a little rough around the edges. I want the baby to look like you, Tetsuya Kun, since you're. <gasps> oh, hell yeah, baby! Ugh, I didn't mean to imply. Oh, what am I saying? It seems Yuko has fallen for you. Oh, hell yeah, make a move, Tetsuya Kun! 
Make a move, baby. You're in a girl's room and she's talking about making babies with you. That's like, damn, that's like Romance 101 right there. All right, this is the eighth social link. Your relationship with Yuko has intensified. It's getting dark out. Please don't get the wrong idea. It was something I saw on TV last night. There was this show about predicting what a baby will look like by combining two people's pictures. That's the only reason I brought it up. I don't want you to misunderstand. Um, hey, it's getting late. Let's call it, call it a night, okay? You left abruptly as if you had been kicked out. Uh, <laughs> well, that was a nice little interaction. Hello, mate. Hello, Vera. Hello, person who got someone killed. All right. All right. Okay. Mitsuru Senpai is a very sharp person inside. I think that's if she got her insides ripped out. I hope she's all right. Nah, she's probably not. I don't understand. What happened to Shihiro, bro? Why can't I clap this, them cheeks? You'll be able to soon, bro. At least I hope. You can't get cucked forever, right? I guess has returned. I'm glad she doesn't have any problems. For whatever reason, she tried to fight against us. I think it hurts her to be here. See us. Can you please forgive her, Tetsuya-kun? No! I don't wanna. Nah, sure. She's my waifu. Well, thank you. I knew you were a kind person. Come on, I... I guess you know you'll be my waifu forever, right? I am truly sorry. Even though he took control of me, I cannot believe I did such a thing to you. Can you ever forgive me? Of course. Thank you very much. I will train hard so that I can be a great help to you. Oh yeah, waifu material right there. Sup, guy who got someone killed? All right. What was Ikutsuki san trying to say? He died before explaining the most important thing. I never thought he would be such uh, capable of doing such a thing. Well, yeah, you were almost capable of killing someone, but that's a whole nother matter entirely. Even if you believe in something, there's no guarantee it will always be true. I wanted to stop believing so many times, but I finally feel good about it. Because in my heart, my dad has always been my dad. Uh, that's a nice way to put it, I guess. Alright, you know what? I spent so much time just fucking around and trying to do all these side quests in the, in the middle of this episode that I've wasted so much time. To the point where it's literally 57 minutes. So I'm gonna leave it off here. In between episodes, I'm just gonna search up the solution to these three quests I have right now because I know there's a deadline on one of the quests coming up on the 11th, I think, where we could get the gourmet cat food from someone. And I wanna complete these three quests I currently have uh, accepted so that I can then move on to that quest. And then the other quest that has a deadline too. And I want to get those two done before we go into Tartarus. And that will be like one week before going into Tartarus. So... Yeah, I have a... I have a little... I don't know. 10 step program, let's say. Of what I want to do next time in Tartarus. But that's gonna have to wait for when we actually get there. Because right now we're just social linking like crazy, bros. Anyways. Thank you all for watching this episode of Persona 3 FES. And I will see you all in the next episode, hopefully. Don't forget to, you know, hit that like button, slap that subscribe button. If you, you know, wanna keep watching my content, this is something that I rarely ask. But, uh, you know, do it do it for me, guys. I'm, I'm best protagonist. I'm blue hair demo protagonist. You can't resist. <laughs>